Welcome to the DIY Honda Garage channel. The Diagnostic Trouble Code DTC B1234, also identified as Indicator 41, indicates a short circuit in the air mix control motor circuit of Honda Civic models from 2011 to 2015. This problem affects the climate control system, particularly the air mix control motor, which regulates the flow of air into the cabin to maintain the desired temperature. The air mix control motor is located in the HVAC, heating, ventilation, and air conditioning system, specifically connected to the climate control unit. It plays a crucial role in blending air from both the heater and the outside air, ensuring optimal cabin comfort. When this motor malfunctions or experiences a short circuit, it may lead to improper temperature regulation inside the vehicle. The HDS, Honda Diagnostic System, is utilized for diagnosing issues, and verifying this DTC is the first step in efficient troubleshooting. The error code B1234 is associated with a malfunction in the air mix control motor circuit, which is essential for regulating the temperature inside your Honda Civic. The air mix control motor is a small but vital component situated within the HVAC system. This motor is responsible for controlling the mix of hot and cold air entering the cabin, making it key for comfort on varying climate conditions. It interacts with the climate control unit, which houses the controls for temperature settings. A short circuit in this motor prevents it from functioning properly possibly leaving the driver and passengers in discomfort due to either excessively hot or cold air. In the event of such a malfunction, a thorough inspection and testing of these components are critical for accurate diagnosis and repair. Understanding the possible causes of DTC B1234 is key to effective troubleshooting. First, wiring issues such as frayed or damaged wires could lead to a short circuit affecting the connectivity between components. Next, a direct short in the circuit could also be causing the issue. When wires touch or connect incorrectly, signals can get disrupted. Additionally, the air mix control motor itself may be malfunctioning, either due to wear, damage, or manufacturing defects. Another consideration is the climate control unit which could also be at fault if it's not delivering the correct commands to the air mix motor. Identifying these potential causes early in diagnostics helps streamline the repair process and ensures that the right parts are checked and replaced as necessary. The symptoms associated with DTC B1234 can significantly impact the driving experience. Drivers may first notice an inconsistent cabin temperature the vehicle could blow hot air when cool air is expected, and vice versa. Owners might also experience a complete malfunction of the climate control system, where controls may seem unresponsive. Additionally, the presence of the error code B1234 on the dashboard indicates a specific malfunction that needs attention. Intermittent issues may lead to surprise temperature swings, even when controls are correctly set. These symptoms highlight not only comfort-related issues, but also suggest potential underlying electrical faults that must be resolved for the climate system to function properly. The first troubleshooting step is to confirm the presence of the DTC B1234. Begin by utilizing the HDS, Honda Diagnostic System, to clear the current DTC codes. Following this, turn the ignition switch to the lock zero position, then return it to the on II position. This reset enables the self-diagnostic feature of the system, allowing it to re-evaluate the climate control unit. You need to check for any DTCs that might appear after this diagnostic cycle. If the DTC B1234 reappears, it confirms the presence of the problem associated with the air mix control motor circuit. If it does not reappear, it may suggest an intermittent failure, prompting you to inspect for loose wires or poor connections in that circuit. 
For the second step in troubleshooting DTC B1234, you'll need to check for shorted wires, specifically the AMDP and S5V lines. First, turn the ignition switch to lock zero to ensure safety. Next, disconnect the climate control unit using its 32P connector and the air mix control motor with its 7P connector. This helps isolate the circuit for accurate diagnostic testing. You'll then check for continuity between the designated test points. Test point one requires you to connect to number 10, gray, on the climate control unit. And for test point two, you will connect to the body ground. Ensure that you also check the S5V test circuit on the same connectors. If there is continuity detected, this suggests a potential short circuit to the body ground, which necessitates repair in the wiring between the climate control unit and the air mix control motor. The third troubleshooting step is to directly check the air mix control motor itself. After ensuring the wiring is intact, test the air mix control motor to determine if it operates correctly. If the air mix control motor is found to be functioning as expected, the implication is that the issue may lie with the climate control unit instead. In this case, you would need to replace the climate control unit to resolve the problem. Conversely, if the air mix control motor fails the test, it indicates that it needs to be replaced. This step is crucial because ensuring proper functionality of both components directly impacts the performance of the HVAC system. Recognizing which part requires replacement based on testing helps avoid unnecessary repairs and streamlines the maintenance process. The final repair verification step involves confirming that all repairs have been properly executed and that the system is functioning correctly. Begin by ensuring that all connections, particularly those associated with the air mix control motor and climate control unit, are resecured. Subsequently, test the system operation to ensure that the cabin temperature regulates correctly according to the selected settings. By running the HVAC system through various settings, you can determine whether it responds accurately. After verifying the operation, use the HDS once more to clear any DTCs that may have been stored. This step ensures that if the repair was successful, no fault codes will be present, indicating a restored system performance. To prevent future occurrences of DTC B1234, implementing a routine maintenance schedule is essential. Regular inspections of wire connections and physical components can help identify issues before they escalate into major problems. It's important to frequently check the condition of wires leading to the air mix control motor and climate control unit. Frayed or damaged wires should be promptly dealt with. Additionally, maintaining the HVAC system can enhance its overall performance, prolonging the life of essential components. Ensuring that filters are clean and the system is servicing in line with manufacturer recommendations can contribute to optimal operation. Being proactive in these maintenance practices will create a more reliable driving experience and can mitigate costly repairs in the future. In summary, DTC B1234 points toward a short in the air mix control motor circuit, which can cause significant disruptions to the climate control functionality in Honda Civic models from 2011 to 2015. The air mix control motor and climate control unit play critical roles in maintaining cabin comfort. Through systematic and detailed troubleshooting, one can identify and rectify the fault efficiently. The importance of both direct testing and wiring inspections during the repair process cannot be overstated. Additionally, establishing a preventive maintenance routine can greatly decrease the likelihood of such trouble codes reappearing. Engaging in these practices will ensure uninterrupted enjoyment of vehicle comfort and performance. Please like and subscribe to the channel. See you next time.